Hello everybody, and welcome to the penultimate episode of Pokéduel, or as I like to call it, the Yugimons Nuzlocke. Uh, I say penultimate since the plan for today is just to do the first two, maybe three Elite Four, and then keep the champion and the final Elite Four for the ultimate final episode. So without further ado, let's just go. Is that Pegasus? No, is that Chef Kowalski or whatever was his name from the rest of game? It's actually... It's Pegasus's uh, alternate thingy. Okay, you've got them. Okay, good thing I changed the bubble man. Uh, let's try and surf. Surf and turf. Okay, so it survived. Come on, Bubble Man, I know you can do this. You're strong, you can take this. Excellent. Excellent, Bubble Man. Excellent. In hindsight, I should have used Water Spout. It would have uh, dealt more damage. Oh my god, it's dead. It is so, so dead. Excellent. Okay, Toon Summon Skull is not something I want to fight. But it is something that Big Shield Gardna would like to take a swing at. Since Gardna has very high defensive stats, both special and physical. And due to the fact that the Gardna actually knows Low Kick, which is super effective against Dark types like Summon Skull. This is going to deal a shit ton of damage. Okay, this should take down the Toon Summon Skull. Excellent. Okay. And another one is down. Toon Dark Magician Girl is not something I want to fight with, so let's switch to Exodia, the forbidden one. Exodia can take the extrasensory attack from Toon Dark Magician Girl. Easy! So let's go ahead and Thunderbolt it. Okay, you're using assist. Fake tears. Interesting. What? You might have that actually had fake tears. Well, doesn't matter, you're dead. <laughs> okay, three more to go. Toon blue eyes. Okay, psychic it away. Thank you, Exodia. I might be. Oh my god, it survived. Okay, let's psychic it. Psychic it again. I'm gonna risk it. Psychic? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Can you see? Yes! Excellent. Okay, and the final is a. Okay. Level 55. Hmm. What to do, what to do. Wait, I know that he, that relinquished is a ghost type. And I know he'll, the, I, the AI will try to use a move that's super effective against. Excellent. Uh, okay, so. Now what I'm going to do is use Hyper Potion on Exodia. Okay, so you've got Ancient Power. We're now going to switch to Exodia again. Because you're probably going to use Ancient Power again. It shouldn't do much. 
Now we're going to Psychic you. How's that? Okay, that was a good call on my part since the Psychic didn't kill. Okay, but Exodia is... If I haven't switched, I would have lost Exodia. And that would be bad. Would have been very, very bad. Okay. Okay, so first Elite Four member down. Three more in champion. God damn it, game. Allow me to go down. Okay, need the potion. So everyone is healed up for the next encounter. Nobody's dead, which is which is very good. Okay, I should have some four heals here as well. Okay, let's see who's who's. Oh, Joey. Um, what he might be starting with? I think he might start with the red eyes. Actually, e, you must be a strong tool to make it this far. Me and my peers are always ready to draw down. So show me what you got. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! That was the worst Joey impression on the internet. Don't quote me. Don't quote me on that. Okay, so that was a good read on my part when it comes to red eyes. Anyway, this Thunderbolt should take this red eyes down. Okay, so Red Eyes is most likely down. Okay. Excellent. Guilford the Lightning. I am scared. Also, this is a uh, electric type, which, uh, oh, which would be not very effective against anything I throw at it. Okay. Now what? Let's try using defense curl. To be perfectly honest, I would have killed it uh, if I just used counter. So that is a thing I might be doing soon with it. Mm. Let's use counter. Holy crap, that's Volt Tackle. So we have Volt Tackle. We've also seen Double Edge. I'm not scared of this Volt Tackle. What else you've got for me? Okay, so we're going to use Volt Tackle again. How much do that do? Okay, about 60. I don't think Big Shield Gardener is faster than Guilford. That was a good read on my part, so let's try and low kick it. Sorry about that. She always comes in when I'm recording. Okay, so we've got Aerial Ace. Um, let's try Protect. For now. Let's go. We're going to scout his moves. Under Aerial Ace. We can take an Aerial Ace. Easy. Surf. 
This should do a little bit of damage. Okay, that's that's actually a lot of damage. I expected a bit since it looked like a fire type, but I didn't expect that much. Um, this is most likely a an electric type. Oh, called it. So you know what? I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to heal Big Shield Guard Knob. Since Black Skull Dragon... Faint attack. Since one of the materials for um, the Black Skull Dragon in the card game is Summon Skull... There is a high possibility that actually it's evolved from some skull, so it might have its uh, its typing as well, and that would make it a dark type. I'm also expecting it to be very, very heavy, so I'm going to low kick. Let's see how this goes. And we're low kicking. Yes! Excellent. Okay. If it goes like like this, we might be able to squeeze the third one. Okay, Jinzo. Protect. Let's scout what you've got for me, Jinzo. Psychic, eh? So we're going to switch to Exodia, the Forbidden One. So he can take the Psychic you've got. And Thunderbolt you. Oh, uh, special defense fell. That ain't bad. That ain't good. But this Thunderbolt should do the trick. Okay, so you're calm minding. Okay, let's use Thunderbolt again. This won't do as much damage as it previously did. Oh, you also know Thunderbolt, okay. Holy crap, that's a lot of damage. Okay, okay. Need to think, need to think. Will I have to sack someone? Because that does about 90 damage. About 100 damage. How much... Okay, Sangha has a little bit of HP. So Sangha can take this Thunderbolt. But I don't think Sangha will be able to take a Psychic. So we're basically, at this point, sacking Sangha. There was no other way. There was no other way. If I had a Dark type... There was no other way for me to deal with this Jinzo. I'm sorry, Sangha. I didn't want to do this. Seriously, you fucking survived. Now you're going to... Okay. So what I'm now going to do is Calm Mind. So my special defenses are, are, will go up. And if our special defense is up, uh, we should be able... Uh, to do much better. Okay, so a Meteor Mash. Okay, so we're going to heal now. Too bad, Sangha. You did good. Okay, so we know that you have a Meteor Mash. You have Psychic, Thunderbolt, and a Calm Mind.
Okay. One more shot should... Well, two more, actually. Should do the trick. Okay. There's a high possibility that he will try and heal again. There it is. There's the heal. So what we need to do, since we're faster... At this point, is call mind of our own. And hope we'll survive this. Because he's going to Thunderbolt. Oh, Meteor Mash, okay. Perfect. So we're going one more Calm Mind. Thank you, keep missing. Excellent. Okay, you can... This shouldn't kill Exodia. Okay. We're almost done with this bastard. God damn it. And this will most likely do next to nothing. We're going final calm mind and then we're sweeping. Since now Exodia is like indestructible. Cannot be touched by special attacks. Exodia is on plus six special attack and plus five special defense. Let's just do this. Okay, this Jinzo was a pain in the butt. But it's fine. It's now dead. And your final mon is a Dark Flare Knight. Okay, Exodia should take it down with a quick Thunderbolt. Especially since it's so boosted. Goodbye, Dark Flare Knight. It was nice killing you. Okay, 